Welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com. New Windows 10 build to look at. This is build 19018 for Windows Insiders on the fast running. This is a 20H1 build. And we're getting right towards the end of development, I guess, with this. I'm pretty sure they're going to see um, the sh sign off or finish development next month uh, and then released early next year. So, what's changed in this build? Well, let's have a look. There is some changes. In the search screen here, Microsoft say they've added some quick searches uh, across the bottom for weather and news and history. Uh, I'm not seeing those. It could be because I'm not in the um, US region settings, so I'll have a play with that and report that back later. But well, they should be there. So I'm not actually seeing those, and that's because um, it's a server side change, so it's US only. And I'm not seeing those on there because uh, I'm my set for UK, but it will be coming soon. What else has changed? Something the search results have changed. Let's try. Let's check something out. So there we get the new search results like that. That's actually quite nice. That I can quite like how they've uh, how they've done that. Um, it's not a major change, but it's nice to see that some changes. Uh, nice to see it tidied up the UI on there. So what else has changed? Well, um, there's uh, a fix for some black screen issues that were a, a, actually a patch on the previous build. They've fixed some ease of access uh, issues. Um, they've fixed some issues with update history. Might show an update having failed even though it uh, actually worked. They fixed some search issues, some CPU issues, um, and there's a narrator issues. The notion issue list is fairly small. There's um, still that battle eye uh, anti cheat software that uh, causes an issue, so don't if you use that, don't go on this build. Uh, there is still some settings um, issues where launching settings from other areas like uh, the network area doesn't work. I haven't seen that issue yet, but um, there are people seeing that and. Um, Printers might not always work from installed from optional updates, and um, the interesting one is if you if a builder attempts to download and install before you have completed the first stage of logging prior to install, you will experience a two-hour window before you can install the new build. I didn't see that; everything worked fine on here. So that's all the changes with this build, 19018. All minor stuff because they've really finished working on this now and uh, we're going to see this go to the slow ring pretty soon i guess so thanks for watching this video you can see more on the digitallifestyle.com on our youtube channel i've got build videos right back to the very first previews of windows 10 and you can find me on twitter at istixon